deaths on Iowa's roads are up an 18% change compared to this time last year. Now there are more people on the road now than during the pandemic, but not changing since last year is the excessive speeding first seen at the beginning of the pandemic. It remains an Iowa State trooper caught someone going 150 miles per hour this month. Local 5's Lake and McGee reports on the triple digit speeds. Troopers say it used to be a rare occurrence to catch someone going over 100 miles per hour on the highway. There's my target. Now it's every day. It's absolutely scary now what our officers and our troopers are seeing out here. Sergeant Alex Dinkla says it's regularly that we're seeing people at 130 and 140 miles an hour out here. Those are speeds that our troopers and officers alone most likely don't even do when they're trying to go to an emergency call because they realize the dangers of driving at those speeds. This is Rob. He's been a trooper since 1994. He says troopers first noticed the triple digit speeds at the beginning of the pandemic. The speeds increased because there's a lot less traffic out there and uh, a lot less cars to slow them down. But the high speeds continue even with more people out on the roads. And I got a taste of what it's like to catch a speeder. 76, 77, 73, 72. Wow, okay, so a lot of speeders. And what's the speed limit through here? 65. 65. With more people speeding, Sergeant Dinkla says there have been more fatalities this year at this time compared to last year. Keep in mind, there is more traffic on the road this year compared to pandemic levels. We are 26 above the mark that we were last year. There are times that we are going to have extra law enforcement out there to try to do enforcement actions because we, we know that that is one effective tool as far as being able to uh, curb some of those bad choices and bad behaviors that we see. If you do get pulled over, remember the dollar amount of the fine goes up the faster you are going. I'm Lake and McGee, Local 5 News. We are Iowa. Yeah, so let's take a closer look at the fines you could be paying. The state of Iowa publishes these dollar amounts every year. The faster you go, the more expensive that ticket. Say you're going 70 over the speed limit. You're looking at a ticket costing $420, and that's without the mandatory 15% surcharge. And keep in mind, school zones are slightly different. You could actually face jail time if going more than 10 over in that zone.